I'll crash with my weapon in my hand and I can still work. Managing distance gets really tricky now, doesn't it? But I'm seeing several occasions here when you're within the range of the weapon, you're getting hits on them while they're getting hits on you. How many, how many rounds does it take on average to stop this determined aggressor? Who has the advantage right now? So let's remember we have options. We can still transition to combatives while we have our pistol in our hand. So I can still crash with my weapon in my hand and I can still work. Drop it, drop the hammer, drop it, drop it, do it now. There's still a lot that I can do here. Drop it, drop the hammer, do it now, right? Let's not forget, we can integrate. What does IDS stand for? Integrative Defense Strategies. So I'm seeing a lot of good stuff happen where you're doing great work with your hands and you're doing great work with your pistol. Drop it, drop the hammer, drop it, drop it, do it now. But let's start thinking about how we can take those things and blend them together a little bit more effectively in our context of defending an innocent third party.